What's inside? Let's go find an ugly Christmas sweater. I feel like I could do better. Most importantly, I'm going to put a Bible in it. <laughs> Why am I actually sobbing right now? <laughs> you good? Yeah! It changed my life completely, and I know it can change yours. Stop the doctor, <laughs> latte with hazelnut could I do soy milk um medium yes could I add an extra shot to that as well that's it thanks you too anyways hi guys what's up welcome back to the vlog today is vlogmas day 12 yeah. it's tech you were just asleep <laughs> that was so creepy she was just knocked out Hi! But it's 1.44. I have done absolutely nothing today. So I was like, I need to get out of the house. I need to go get a coffee. I need to start my day. I feel a million times better today also, by the way. Yesterday we had a sick day. Um, I took an immunity shot, oregano oil, emergency, ate soup, got some rest. Halo actually went straight to bed after that last clip yesterday. I was so scared that she was gonna be up so long, but I don't know why she was acting like she wasn't tired. I put her in her crib with her bubba and she was zonked. So I got a good night's sleep last night. Wanted to stop and get some coffee. And then I need to go to like TJ Maxx or a Marshalls or something because I need to get an ugly Christmas sweater. And every year they have really cute ones that are like pre-made already. Tomorrow we have a virtual Bible study. Supposed to wear ugly sweaters. So I gotta go get that. What? And yeah, I think that's it. Oh, I'm going into downtown today and I know that I wanted to bring my little package that I made for, I don't, Hi. Sorry about You're that. Right. Um, so our espresso machine just stopped working completely so oh. we aren't able to do the extra shot in the ice, the ice latte. I just got caught. But anyways, yeah, I have this basket for, <laughs> I'm so embarrassed. I don't know what to do. I'll talk to you guys in a second. Okay, I don't know if you guys just heard that, but apparently their espresso machine just stopped working. Let's try our cold brew. It's a cold brew, hazelnut, and soy milk. Mmm. It's so good. That has like a nutty flavor to it. Mmm. Coffee house. Oh my gosh, that is so good. They're expensive though. I think they are more expensive than Starbucks. Anyways, about this package that I want to give to somebody. I still don't know who I'm going to give it to. I am going downtown today, so I feel like my chances of seeing someone that is in need of it will be very high. But yeah, it's just a nice gesture. There's just like a blanket and some water bottles, candy, cake, little like essentials kit. Most importantly, I'm going to put a Bible in it. This is the first Bible that I read start to finish. I'm currently reading my new Bible now. Kind of has a little bit of wear and tear on it, but I feel like it just has like special place in my heart and I know that God will do the right thing with it. No matter like what I do with it, if I give it to this person and they hate it and they throw it on the ground and they don't want anything to do with it, like I know that it's going to end up with somebody that needs it, if that makes sense. But yeah, I also need to get like a bag or something to put this in because this basket is just not practical. It's kind of heavy. Hi. Oh, here, I forgot. I have your bubba. Here. I see loose roosters. I'm not kidding. <laughs> Camera will pick it up. Do you see that little thing in the yard right there? It's a rooster. <laughs> oh no. Oh, bye rooster. Let's go find an ugly Christmas sweater. This is option number one. Obviously I'd put like a longer sweater or something underneath of it. The only issue is I think it's cute. I don't think it's ugly sweater vibes, you know? I have to like keep my knee here. Okay, this is number two. But it's also pretty cute, I don't know. It, why am I not picking out actual sweaters? I'm picking out vests. I don't know, I think my plan would be to put like a crazy different colored sweater underneath to make it ugly. You better sit back, miss. All right, I have one more thing to try on. This is a skirt, but I would put an ugly sweater underneath of it and then just put this on top. I don't know. These are all terrible, honestly. I feel like I could do better, but of course I procrastinate and wait until the last day to do this. Did we choose the right one? So you're gonna have to come back and see tomorrow which one we chose. I just got back in the car. I went to TJ Maxx and I found this bag. They're like 99 cents. 
and this will be like easy for them to carry everything and it's not gonna be heavy. Just got finished writing the little card and I'm gonna read it to you guys. So in the Bible, it specifically says that you shouldn't be like boasting about what you're doing, about your good deeds, about any of that. And I'm not boasting about it. This is truly in my heart to do this because God has planted that desire in me and I'm doing it for his glory and I'm doing it because he is good, not because I'm good. So hopefully this can inspire you guys to do just maybe one good deed this holiday season because in a time of such like a dark, dark world, it is so important to be the light for people and to remind them that God is still good and that there is goodness in this world. So I'm gonna read you guys what I wrote, it's super quick. I just said, hi, I have no idea who you are, what your circumstances are or how I even ran into you, but I truly feel like God has been pushing me to do something small but meaning meaningful for someone I don't know. You happen to be that exact person that God chose for me. All I wanted to do is spread some joy in a time where the world is so dark and I don't know exactly what you're going through right now, but God does and he loves you and wants to bless you. If you've been been struggling at all this is your sign to look up to the father and just talk to him because he's listening I put a Bible in here and I pray that you just open it it changed my life completely and I know it can change yours Jesus loves you and I will be praying for you so here's to all the blessings that I know you'll receive this year much love the person that God sent to you to make your day a little bit brighter and I just wrote please read me <laughs> on the way here I passed so many people that I felt like I could have given it to but I just wanted to make sure that I had everything in here and if I don't feel like the time is right I'm not just gonna forcibly just give it to a random person like I really I'm I'm gonna pray about it on my drive home. Just like, God, if it's meant to go to someone today, please just point that person out to me. Hi, sir. God bless you. There is a note in there. All I ask is that you read the note. But there's a bunch of goodies and stuff in there. So I hope you have a great Christmas season. God bless you. Merry Christmas. What? That's all I ask. Read the note. <laughs> And God loves you. Why am I actually sobbing right now? <laughs> I've been crying way too much ever since giving birth to Halo. Like my hormones are crazy. Like it was literally nothing. I didn't even end up putting money or a gift card in there. I was gonna put a gift card, but I don't know. I felt like God just wanted me to give something that didn't distract from him, if that makes sense. Like. I don't know. I'm like crying, but that felt so good to do. I'm not kidding guys. Like it feels so much better to give than receive. And this just proves like it doesn't have to be something big or something extravagant. Um, good. Good. Another vlogmas, another haul. Baby, can I turn off? Yeah. All right, we just got back home from TJ Maxx. I went there because I needed to get an ugly Christmas sweater, which we secured, but you'll see tomorrow. I also got a couple random things. So I got this Texas Hold'em poker set for Sam and I because we've been loving playing poker ever since we went on the cruise. He was in a tournament and we just wanted to play at home, us too, but we've been playing with paper. So it's been like, it's been so toshky. got a bunch of like wrapping presents supplies. Oh my God, come here, come here. <laughs> Guys, all she wants is that camera. She's obsessed. I have never been that person that has showed up with cute Christmas presents, but that is changing this year. So we got bows, silver, gold, pearl, bronze. I think I showed you guys a while back, but I did get wrapping paper from Target. This is a little box. Look at this puff ball. Ba -la 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 -la. I also got this box. I just thought it was cute and simple. I got these bags for little gift bags. They say cool and it comes with a set of three, but I thought that was funny. Lily is getting one of them. And then I got this Santa sack. I'm not gonna really get into it in this video. I'll save it for a different video because I don't wanna rant on. But the way that I'm gonna give Halo gifts this year, I'll just have to explain it to you. But basically she's only gonna get three gifts and then stocking stuffers and I'll explain all of it later, but this is her stocking instead of a traditional stocking. So yeah, that is everything that I picked up from TJ Maxx. Hey, look, come here. Let's open up the advent calendars. Come here. Come here. Okay, we're actually gonna open up the nativity calendar first because yesterday I let Sam open up the advent calendars and he forgot the nativity, of course. So we have to open up 11 and 12 today. Ready? 11, what's inside? It's a horsey, look how cute. Oh wait, no, it's a donkey. Not me telling my child the wrong animals. We got the little donkey. Donkey! 
This is what Jesus wrote. That was 11. Here's number 12. <gasps> That's a horsey. Now we got the horsey and the donkey. Yay! Yeehaw. Now we gotta open up your bag. We switch every day from opening her box filled with squishies. So every other day she opens up a box and gets a little squishy animal that is hand crocheted by my mom. Very impressive if I must say. And then every other day she opens up a bag that has a little Tony's character in it. Here, can you open up a bag? Oh, she just went back and grabbed the donkey. I don't want you to put him in her mouth because he's tiny. <coughs> is that the bag you want? You picked it out by yourself. Good job. Go ahead, rip it open. It's the snowman. Oh, he's cute. And this one is an audiobook on the book, The Snowman and the Snow Dog. Want to help mommy open her? Here, do you want to tell me what number I should do? Hey, look, look. Okay, she's not making this shit anymore. I'm going to do number two. Oh, I like these socks. These are now my new favorite ones. Socks of the day. And then we have... A Target gift card it does not get better than this. And then we have a scratch off. I forgot I have a quarter in my pocket. I came prepared today. Let's see if we win today. Loser, number two. Loser, number three. Loser, number four. Loser, number five. Loser, and number six. Another loser. All right, I think we're gonna go have some leftover soup from yesterday for dinner. I'm honestly not even sure how much footage I got today. If it's not a lot and if today was a flop, I'm sorry. But of course, I'll be back tomorrow with another video. Hey, thank you guys so much for watching. I love you all the time. It's a Millie, Billy, Trilly, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye, guys. Get your boots, Marcy. <gasps> Get your boots.